Let's learn how to fix the error that says failed to find Roblox process. So if you are getting an error message that looks something like this, make sure to follow my steps and watch this video until the end so you don't make any mistakes. And without wasting your time, let's start right away. You want to go to your desktop and then right click on your taskbar. Then open the task manager from here. We want to find the Roblox task in here and end it with just one click. It should be at the very top of our task manager, and here it is. Select this Roblox game client and then end task in the bottom right corner of your screen. Once you've done that you can exit this and then go over to your search bar in the bottom left corner of the screen. In here, search for run and you'll get this little program so open it. You can also open this program by clicking the Windows key and the R letter at the same time on your keyboard. When you open the window, type percent, app data, percent. So when you type this, click on OK and it's going to open up the folder that we need in order to fix this error. At the top it should say app data and then roaming, so make sure that this specific folder is opened. We should see a folder called KRNL, and since I'm not experiencing that specific error I don't have that folder, but if you see it just delete it completely. And when you delete the KRNL folder we want to go back one folder into this app data section and then open the local folder right here. Now in here we want to find our Roblox folder. Here's mine so I'll just open it by double clicking. And we'll see all of these files inside of the Roblox folder, and if I open this logs folder, you can see that we have a bunch of text documents that we don't really need so you want to go back and delete the logs folder completely. After these two steps you should be able to run and play Roblox without any problems. But if that didn't work, then I would recommend that you turn off or disable your antivirus. Depending on what antivirus you have installed, just run the program and disable it. I don't have a third-party antivirus program installed so I'll just go to my Windows Defender, then go to the Virus and Threat Protection and then I'll disable this real-time protection. This is going to disable the antivirus on my PC and hopefully after this I should be able to run Roblox. So I hope this video helped you out, and if it did then leave a comment down below and I'll see you in the next video.